What's in the box, man? What's in the box? It's shirts. Shirts are in the box. How's it going, YouTube world? Uh, Toby from Toby's Brain here again. Uh, it's been a little while since my last video. Uh, I think that was back in September when I made uh, my annual dragon drawing for my wife. Uh, I did a time lapse, posted that. Um, I, I have been busy. Life keeps me busy, but I have been making art. Uh, if you follow me on Facebook or Instagram, you've seen some of the stuff I've been working on. Um, I just haven't done any other further time-lapse stuff of my actual art process because it's time-consuming and I haven't had time to do it. Um, but I did recently finish a uh, new design for a shirt. Well, one of my one of my own shirts here, um, and uh, I placed an order for one for myself and my family, my wife, my kids all wanted some and. As I was placing the order, I was realizing that there were a bunch of my own shirts that I don't own, uh, which seemed wrong. So I ordered some, and that arrived just yesterday. Uh, and so I figured we'd do a little unboxing, because why not? That's safe to open a box with, right? got here. This is a... So this is the newest design. I'm trying out a new shirt brand. I usually print all my shirts on uh, the Anvil shirts. Uh, I'm trying out the Bella and Canvas because it's slightly better rated. And I'm also trying them out in uh, offering them as gray in addition to black. So, there we go. Pretty cool. So that's one. It's like Christmas in February, sort of. Good old plunger monkey ninja. That's when I first came up with the idea to try to make and sell shirts. This is one of the one of the earlier designs I did, and then waited several years before I figured out how to actually print them and make them available. It's another one of the original shirt designs here. I think I've only got one shirt in this simple graphic style uh, posted right now, but I do have a bunch of other designs and uh, things I'm working on in this kind of uh, theme. Nice, clean, and simple. one. Purple. Purple Cat. Uh, this one, if you don't know the story, was originally a drawing that I did for my youngest son when he uh, moved on up from elementary school to middle school. He loves cats. He loves the color purple. And uh, 
So I drew this form to include in his yearbook. Uh, it used to say, you know, personalized message there for him. Uh, so I had to change that up. The only shirt available in purple right now. And more samurai shirt, samurai shirt, samurai shirt. Here's one. Another earlier design I did that I realized I never purchased for myself. My kids have have this one. It's the multi-purpose novelty squid that uh, if you follow the adventures of Plunger Monkey in my comic strip, it's Plunger Monkey Dynamo Time. This is the fabled multi-purpose novelty squid that Plunger Monkey and myself are on a quest to find. Looks like I found it already. Um, that one. So some of these are duplicates, the ones for my wife and my kids. And then there's this one, the very first shirt for my Plunger Monkey Designs Etsy store. The very first shirt I did and made available. And uh, I have my own uh, copy version copy of a shirt? That doesn't make sense. I had one of these shirts, uh, and somehow it developed a tear somewhere down there, and I was pretty disappointed about it. Um, so I figured I ought to have a new one. But now I do. Uh, so, this shirt I'm actually redrawing. I'm going to do a version 2, or 2.0. Um, if you have been following some of my comings and goings, uh, you'll know that I have been contemplating making some stickers available, uh, taking some of these designs, turning them into stickers. Stickers are a big thing again now, it seems like. I've seen other artists do them, uh, and I see a lot of stickers on laptops and notebooks and other things. So. Uh, they're cheaper than the shirts, so I figured it might be a good way to get my designs out there and uh, generate a little revenue. Um, so I've been converting some of the designs into stickers, and I decided I definitely had to do this one, the, the original Plunger Monkey Dynamo shirt, and uh, discovered, actually I discovered a couple years ago, that the original Photoshop document, the layered file, is corrupted. So I couldn't open it, and all I had was the single layer transparency that I used to upload to actually print the shirts. So I decided, instead of going through all of the, uh, the, the, the steps to try and figure out why it's corrupted, how it's corrupted, can I revert to an older version of Photoshop and still open it? Um, which is like technical stuff that's way out of my league. I decided I'll just redraw the darn thing. Uh, so that's what I'm doing. And uh, that should be done early next week. And then I'll send all of my designs off to order some samples of stickers. And uh, if they look good, then they'll soon be available after that. So, that's it from this unboxing, I guess. I've got some shirts to hand out to uh, my family members here. And uh, we'll see you next time, whenever the heck that is. Bye. Go buy shirts. <laughs>